There aren't many hot button issues that can rile up movie fans like the issue of spoilers. Some movie and TV fans will go so far as to avoid watching trailers, previews, or even avoid social media in general prior to a movie's release to avoid the dreaded spoiler. Arguments and online backlash erupt over intentional or inadvertent details of a story being revealed, families torn apart, marriages ruined, friendships ended all over spoilers. We've even created a new phrase in the English language to give a heads up about something being potentially spoiled in something we're about to say. Spoiler alert! Movie critics today try as best they can in their reviews to give an actual meaningful perspective on film without revealing fragments of information that could be considered, by some, as spoilers. And that raises the biggest trouble with spoilers. There's no one agreed upon definition of what a spoiler even is. Some people will only consider major surprises in a movie as being a spoiler, whereas some other people will be far more sensitive and will even consider revealing there's a car chase in the movie as being a spoiler. I mean, if we can't even agree on what a spoiler is or isn't, how can we avoid them? How do we have meaningful discussions about films and TV shows when we don't even know how much to reveal is okay and how much is not? I mean, some feel spoilers completely ruin a movie or a TV show. A common phrase we often heard spoken after a spoiler is revealed in a conversation is, well, you've completely ruined the movie for me. Now, to make the matter even more cloudy, along comes the new HBO series, The Last of Us a series based on a popular video game franchise of the same name. Now, to say the series has been well-received would be a huge understatement. As of this recording, both the audience and the critic scores for The Last of Us are in the high 90s, with the critic rating being an insane 99%. The show is getting rave reviews from fans and critics alike, and from people who have played the games and those who have not played the games alike. And this raises an interesting question. Considering nearly 40 million copies of The Last of Us games have been sold, and these people know exactly what is going to happen in the series, for the most part that is, and they are loving and enjoying the show every bit as much as those people who have never played the games and have no idea what's going to happen, we have to at least ask the question, do spoilers actually matter? I mean, let's say The Last of Us wasn't a game, and this series was completely original, and the day before the show premiered, a friend of you, a friend of yours, I should say, told you a few things. Number one, Joel's daughter, yeah, she dies. Or the girl Joel is delivering, Joel finds out that she's the last hope of humanity and ending the plague. Or any of the major developments that are still coming, including how the show ends and how it comes to its conclusion. Now, let's say that friend of yours told you all this stuff the day before you sat down to watch the show. Obviously, you'd probably be angry at that friend of yours for spoiling it and ruining the show for you. But here's the thing. Many of us do know the game and its story already. We knew all the things that were going to happen in the first episode and most of the things that are going to happen in the show moving forward. And yet, everyone still absolutely loved the show. Knowing what was going to happen in advance didn't seem to hinder anybody's love or enjoyment or experience of the show. Knowing the spoilers didn't affect any of our enjoyment. And it's not just The Last of Us. Most of us knew long before watching certain movies exactly what was going to happen in them and exactly how they would end. Titanic, Moneyball, Argo, The Lord of the Rings, King Richard, I, Tonya, Elvis, Tick, Tick, Boom, Lincoln, Apollo 13, and the list goes on and on. Film history is filled with movies that audiences go into already knowing major story points and even how they end, and yet they are some of the best and most celebrated movies of all time. And look, to be clear, I am not saying that spoilers don't matter. I'm simply saying the fact that everyone seemed to be loving the experience of watching The Last of Us equally, regardless of if they knew nothing about the story going into it, or if they knew practically everything about the story going into it, should at the very least make us examine how important spoilers actually are or aren't. What do you guys think about this? Whatever your thoughts, please do jump down into the comment section below and carry on the conversation there. That will do it for me, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. My name is John Campia, and Rosebud was the name of the sled.